Today I'll be doing Instacart only for the day. I wanted to see just how much money we could make in just under five hours and here's how that went. Today we're gonna be back at Costco. There was not a shipped promo, so we're back out here doing Instacart. Yesterday was actually really good. I saw a ton of orders nonstop on a Wednesday, which is just weird. Would have been nice to stay out here, but it just didn't happen. Hopefully today is pretty good as well. The drop should be happening in either two or six minutes. Um, not too sure. Right now we got a whole lot of nothing. There are a couple of orders that I want to go over that I saw this morning that make no sense. Before the drop, take a look at this order. We got nine items and eight units. What's going on there? Usually the units are higher than the items. It doesn't make sense. Like, is one of the items like a negative? Or, or do you think like there's a special request on there? Like, I, I don't get that one. Also, June 15th is when fuel assistance stops. And sure enough, we're seeing orders without fuel assistance now, despite the gas prices being even higher than before. So yeah, very epic. Anyways, let's see if we get order at the 9.58 drop. We got one minute. It's 9.58, let's see what happens. All right, this is probably a super weird angle, but nothing happened at 9.58, so we're gonna be looking at 10.02 for the next drop. All right, 10.02, let's see what happens. They got me with that fake drop, just a total line order. I've been told refreshing all the time isn't the best. Not sure about that, but we're trying it. All right, we see one order for $18. Is that the drop? The $18 order wasn't bad. Um, I would have done it. Now I see a $16 one going way far away this is weird normally the drops like actually like a drop like you see like 10 orders but i've seen two under 20 dollars which is not too normal for my area all right we're gonna cross our fingers um i'm probably not gonna record me taking the next order because who knows how long it's gonna be the drops acting a little weird i think they're playing around with it oh we see 18 oh it's the same order geez 20 miles only a $2 tip from two customers. All right, I'll see you guys in a minute. All right guys, so we sat at Costco for about 30 minutes and we ended up getting a $20 HEB order that was really low in miles, super low in items. I think it was only seven items, but I see one thing, they have like some herb and they want seven or six of those. And usually there's only a couple, so I might have to do a refund there. All right, um, I'll see you back here, I guess. Easy order, but um, like I was saying earlier, I was worried about those herbs being out of stock and they only had four and they wanted six. So I let them know and they're still happy that they're able to get four. Partial refund and then one replacement. The very end, they stopped responding for like five minutes. So it slowed me down a tiny, but I'm not worried about it because the drop off is so close. We got a eight minute drive. So we just dropped that off. We're now $20 richer. It didn't go down too much for that one refund, which is nice. I think we're gonna head back to Costco because I need to get some gas and uh, we're gonna hope for a nice order there since we kind of didn't get anything in the morning, unfortunately. This $20 order may have taken us a total of like 40 minutes, so that's pretty good. And we're getting the Costco gas. Guys, right, so we just filled up. We're uh, looking at all of the orders, all the possibilities here to take whole lot of nothing. Here in Texas, it's gonna be above 100 for the next week at least. So I'm making sure to actually be using this right now. Definitely helps if you guys aren't running the car, it keeps it a little cooler. If you guys are running the car, you don't have to blast the AC quite as much, saving you a little bit of gas money. As always, I'll have a link to one of these down below. They're very important. If you're a gig driver, you gotta have one. Ooh, don't mind if I do. That was weird, they both happen at the same time. $27, 11 miles, low items is pretty good. As long as it's not all water, please, please. No water, sweet. Yeah, yesterday we had that big heavy order. I messed my back up really bad. I don't know what I did, but I made some weird twisting motion and my whole neck and back. I see my buddy waiting on the other side of the lot and I guess he didn't take the order, I didn't see it. He's been waiting there for a while too, so I feel bad. Maybe he's just smarter and knows that this was a bad batch, who knows? All right, let's go knock this out. All right, pretty easy order, one refund. All right, our 
first drop off is to an apartment. We have no gate code, so that's cool. The lady that almost crashed into me is still working here today, so it's nice and awkward. First drop off, seven minutes away. Pretty sure this is a customer I've delivered to in the past. They're actually pretty nice. I think last time they increased their tip for me, so greatly appreciated there. And uh, maybe it'll happen again, maybe not. Either way, I'm happy just to be working. Someone else I know that works here had to go home early because it was so slow. Alright guys, so we just got a $22 order that was only like three or six miles from the store on the way back to Costco. So it kind of feels like old times. I don't see any of the normal Costco people. I think they all quit because it was so slow this morning while I was doing HEB. And now there's like no competition it seems like. So I'm actually getting orders on the way back to Costco. Which is kind of cool. We're not doing like crazy big orders, but we're still getting something, making some money. I'm happy with that. We had to do two replacements for that order and unfortunately I found one of the items that I had to refund this morning. Apparently they put the watermelons in a spot where they never put produce. I looked forever and they were by bed sheets. Yep. So that sucks but at least I know where they're at now. feel pretty bad I refunded that though for that other customer. Yeah we're only five minutes away from the first drop off. It is a business so. Alright, so we just dropped off our last order. I couldn't record the one to a business, but this one was pretty easy. I know I walked through a yard and committed a great sin, but in the past she asked me to walk through her grass just to save me time. She's a really nice lady, and um, that's the only time I ever walk through grass. So right now we're at $67, pretty close to four hours of work. We had a, a really rough start to this morning, but we've been getting consistent orders, so we're doing all right. Let's hope for a nice big Costco order after this one. All right, so we just pulled in, got an order immediately. No waiting today, which I'm pretty happy about. I'm gonna finally try and eat my food because I am too hungry to miss this, and then I'm gonna go do this order. But this should get me to 110 to 115 and then i could probably do like one or two shipped orders back where i live and then call it a day two carts Alright, so one replacement, no refunds. I was able to get the watermelon this time. They're both apartments though, so that's not exciting. I don't think either of them are first floor. Yeah, it should be fun. Should be fun.
been looking for my camera keep dropping it so I have no idea how much that actually recorded but super nice people and we're at 120 I think um, I'll probably try and do one more order maybe two more maybe two small ones who knows something to make that a little closer to 150 especially with uh, me slacking off yesterday got to make some of that money back all right guys so I'm gonna end the video here I'm probably gonna do a little bit more work but I'm gonna go home and take a little break and do some editing so I could get this video out on time today our hourly rate was still decent still above 20 and we made just around 21 and a half dollars per hour yes even the halves count here we only worked five and a half hours and made 120 which I think is pretty sweet but like I was saying I'm probably gonna go out and do some shipped orders later tonight when things pick up on that platform so hopefully we can make another 20 to 30 dollars in like an hour later tonight anyways thank you guys for watching this video I'll see you guys on the next one